You're watching Insight, a North Shore Schools instructional technology episode. The North Shore Data Dashboard is a tool for use by teachers, administrators, and other staff to examine student data in an effort to inform instructional practices and interventions. In this video, I will show you how to navigate the basic features and screens in the dashboard and how to change your password. In a web browser, navigate to dds.nsd.org. Log in using these conventions. Your username is your email username without the at nsd.org. Be sure to include any numbers. Your password is your last name followed by your employee number without any leading zeros. If you're assigned to multiple campuses, append the school abbreviation to your password to see data for that school. Notice that this means you have multiple passwords if you're assigned to multiple schools. You'll want to be sure to change your password when you first log in, so I'll show you how to do that now. Click on your name in the upper right hand corner. Here you can see two fields labeled password. Type your new password in both fields and click Save My Info. Now let's explore some of the data displays in the system. I'm logged in as an elementary teacher. The home screen for elementary teachers shows the demographic data, special ed status, primary language, and state testing data for the previous year for all of the students assigned to me. In the displays for reading, math, and writing, hovering over a wedge of the pie tells me the percent of students in that group. Further down, I can see displays for the demographic information for my class, languages, gender, and special ed status. To see specific student assessment data, I just need to click on the student's name in the list. The display shown gives me a summary of this student's assessment data for the years he was tested. To get back to the whole class, I can click on the grade level link in the left-hand navigation. I can choose a specific assessment by using the links at the top for the assessment and grade level I want to look at. I'll click on the Math Benchmarks Assessment for Grade 5. In this screen, I can sort the results by clicking on one of the column headers, such as Level, Total Score, or one of the core content areas. You'll see other displays with clickable column headings in other places in the system as well. This display shows all the dates this assessment was administered, but clicking on one of the dates up at the top shows me just the scores from that instance of the assessment. I can also show aggregate results from my class or building by using the graph links here. Here's the link for class graph, here's the link for building graph. I'll click on class graph. Let's explore more of the left navigation. Clicking on AYP shows me AYP data for my school broken down by demographic groups. The bar shows me visually how well that group of students did on that particular assessment. Clicking on State Assessment gives me a display that shows the percent of students in each assessment level for my class and another display that shows the results for all students at my school for comparison. Again, hovering over a pie wedge gives me more information about that wedge. Clicking on Grade 5, as stated before, will take me back to the home screen. This grade level will match your grade level, of course. I'm logged in as a fifth grade teacher. Clicking on Level shows the same display as the State Assessment link. Clicking on Scale shows a scale score summary for state assessments. Here, clicking on a column header takes me to a display specific to that assessment. I'll look at the raw score graph of individual scores for grade three for these, this group of students in reading. Clicking on former students shows me a display of students assigned to me last year and their state assessment score history. I need to choose the school year in order to see the students. 
I can't sort the columns here, but I can look at individual test histories for these students. The left navigation also shows links to the OSPI site, where I can see more information about my school and about the state assessments. If you need help with your account or your password, please call the Data Dashboard Hotline at 7626. For all other questions, please send an email to dds at nsd.org. For more insights, please visit www.nsd.org insight.